Hi everyone, I'm your local Green Schools Officer Rob and this Green Schools Marine Week we've chosen to champion five marine animals. The eagle, the starfish, the seahorse, the manatee and the penguin. Join us for our draw along sessions and learn how to draw each of these marine animals. Hi everyone, welcome to today's draw along session uh, and today we are going to learn how to draw the starfish. So here's one I did earlier and coloured in just so you can have a look and see what it is. So we're going to look at common starfish. So as before, we're looking to use a pencil. You might need a sharpener and a rubber just so you can draw along and then when you're finished you'll need some sort of colours to colour it in. Now I'm going to use a pen. I use a pen so it shows up better for you guys on the video but I recommend you use a pencil. Okay so to start with our, 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 our starfish or our sea star some people would call it we're going to try and use as much of the paper as we can but we're going to start right in the centre. So if you imagine a star, it has five points to it. So what we're going to do is we're going to start with five circles. So a little circle here, a little circle here, a little circle here, a little circle here, and a little circle here. And that's going to be the top of our starfish. And off of each of these five circles, we're going to do a row of circles out the starfish's arms. So we'll start up the top, circle here, circle here, circle, 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 circle. And that's going to be one of his arms out. Same again from this, all the way out. Another arm. Another arm. And the same again, more circles all the way out. We have another arm and the same for the last arm or leg all the way out, circles. Okay, that gives us a kind of an idea of how big our starfish is going to be. And to give us kind of, before we fill in his arms, we're going to do a kind of a little cluster or a little grouping of, of circles and each of these last dots on our arm. So just one, two, three, four, five. Doesn't have to be five, but a few circles on each of these. One, two, three. Just like this. And it gives us an idea of how wide the arm is going to be as well. Then I'm imagining how that arm is going to fit into the body of the starfish. So I'm going to do just a few circles to kind of show where that line of that arm is going to be. So if it's a nice fat arm here, we'll do one here, we'll do one here, one here, one here, one here, one here, one here, one here. right? And then we're going to join those with a line all the way up. And then it's coming back down, all the way down. And we can see that this is the first point of our star or the first arm done. And the same, I'm gonna do a few circles here because starfish, they have lots of little bumps on them. So that's what we're doing with the circles. We're going to give it the texture of a starfish and how it feels and looks. So we'll bring this right the way around, we'll join up We'll come and join all these circles up, all the way up and down into a nice curve and we have the second arm done. So we're going to do the same for all of the arms, so I'll do a few circles here. Doesn't matter how many or where these circles are, just a few or loads and joining them up. we get the shape of our starfish. So we're gonna to come to a point here again, and then we're gonna bring it back down and join all of these lines up 
to get our starfish. Nice curved line in here. And back out again. We're doing a few circles. Maybe some of these circles are really close together. And we're joining all of these up together. We bring the point right into that circle. Join them up. And we come back down to the curve. And then we're doing the same for our last arm. So another cir circles along the lines that you want to do for each edge of the arm. And then we'll join them. So a nice curve joining these two and then straight lines coming out. We want to bring it to a point like that and then coming back in on this side. And you can see our starfish is almost there. So I'm going to add a little bit more texture. So a little bit more of those circles that make up the body that make it look and feel like it is right in in these little sections here right in its little armpit for want of a better word right in at these curved sections so just a grouping of circles in an almost in a little triangle like this and again in here and again in here and again in here. And that is our starfish, or sea star, as some people like to call them. Uh, again, you want to get your colors out now. Pick out the colors you want to color in your starfish. And this is what I did with mine. So nice reds and oranges. Um, and we have our nice colored in starfish.